what's up guys grism in here and welcome back to some more oak and stone it's been quite a while to be honest and <laughs> today uh, we are doing a soft reset for the server thank you and what that basically means is we've reset the world spawn and uh, the spawn point and we've kept the world uh, we've changed the amplified terrain to default terrain and we've moved everything 130,000 blocks from original spawn and uh, because of the soft reset we can keep our inventories in ender chest if we want now I'm getting rid of my inventory however I've got my ender chest here all set up basically this side here is for things that I'm probably going to need because we have not decided what we're gonna do with the end um, we don't know if we're gonna reset it or if we're going to change some things in there we don't know we haven't talked about it yet so I want to keep these just in case um, the good thing is we can always come back uh, to this part of the world it's just gonna be a very long trek to get here so I've also got a shulker shell and a box now the shulker shell doesn't do much um, however the bed this is pretty much just in case I need it um, things that I might need uh, went over there and then this side is the relics uh, this bow is because it's got mending and infinity now if you don't know mending and infinity can't go on the same thing anymore uh, in the newest snapshots you can't get it so this is actually really cool uh, so I'm actually gonna put this in like a museum or something maybe I'll build a museum uh, to house uh, everyone's artifacts and stuff that they want to keep um, and then the golden apples are because I found them in dungeons uh, this golden apple was in a, one dungeon this one was in a separate separate dungeon which is awesome and then this was my first beacon and I kind of want to keep it just as a reminder that it takes a very long time to get wither skulls <laughs> it took me hours to get that um, so I'm going to kill myself in game of course as I slowly slowly drift away um. all right we're back all right so, what's going to be happening is we're starting over. Yeah. <laughs> um, here in the village. Wow. Nice looking house. <laughs> okay. Cool. Um, so, this is... This is kind of the road that he wants to do out um, jungle. That that's actually a nice place. Alright. First night, I don't know if they have anything. I'm rummaging through oot stuff. Nothing up in the attic, okay. That's eh, perfectly fine. That's no bother. Uh, 
I better not run. I don't have any food yet. Okay. So, uh, the plans that I want to do with this one. Uh, we want to start just by... Oh, front door. But um, we want to start and work in the desert uh, for a bit until we kind of grow out. So we're not sure how long it's going to be, but we're kind of wanting to just kind of stay. Yeah, so I'm going to be building a some type of house, I'm not sure. Okay. Well, Kuru is very nice. <laughs> Other than uh, the sheep slave that she's currently got. Okay, so first things first, I need to get wood. Now we have a jungle right over here, which is good. Because that means that there's plenty of wood. Alright. So, let's work. Oh. oh no. I died. No, 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 no. There's a spider. There's a spider. And a skeleton. Yeah, I need to run. Run very far. Run very fast. Okay. Whew. Okay. Now that that's all good, let's figure out Okay Just make my bed here Can we? Can we please? Please? Not sure she's actually going to do anything, so Okay. Well, I need wood. 
let's try and figure out what we can do. Because I currently don't have anything at all. And I almost want a corner lot. This could be good though. Okay, that's not good. Almost need to wait for day. Day's coming though. And yeah, maybe we'll we'll deal with this stuff in daytime. Just to um we'll do this. Okay. Uh ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm going to harvest some carrots. I don't think he's gonna mind. Okay. Okay, hunger's pretty much full. Okay. Let's go to the jungle. Maybe do some stuff. Nope. Oh, she scared me. Okay. Let's... Let's just go right here. Now let's get this tree here. Because this one's shorter. Nope. Uh, there's a husk as well. Okay, dokey. I need to run for my life. Cause I, I am I am naked and afraid. I, I am not cut out for this job. <laughs> okay. Alright. Daytime's upon us. That means we can start gathering up stuff. Let's chop this tree down quick. Da, 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 da. One more. Now, uh, my plan for when we start venturing out. Basically, all I want to do is I want to build underwater. Um, I'm not sure why, but I do. Hopefully we can get some spruce saplings. I love, yes, I got one spruce sapling. That's good. Grab some dirt. Okay, I got seven, I think eight logs in total here. Yes, eight logs. Good. Okay, we'll come back to this. Okay. Um, in fact, I'm actually going to do something. I'm going to go and beat up a husk. Get dead. I'm gonna punch him. Punch him to death. Give me food. Good. He died. Okay. Yes. Hehehe. <laughs> I could do this all day. Get back. We dropped a potato. And he dropped a potato. Okay. Come here, pig. Yes, pork chops. Good. Any more saplings? Two. I got two saplings. Because this kind of... It's kind of far. Yeah, it's kind of far, though. Although, I 
kind of want to have a water a water oasis type of thing in here yeah I think I think I'm gonna do that I think I'm gonna go off right here so let's plant some there I got trees here as well that's just good okay so let's go ahead let's set up camp over on this side here okay so I need wooden or stone pickaxe got it I need a stone axe got it sword got it and a shovel okay with one to spare okay and we'll use the wooden tool first okay I also need to cook that I've got a torch place my bed down down here as well let's go ahead let's chop up some more trees just so get some more wood because I'm actually going to use uh, I think I'm going to have to design this um, I always do I always design stuff before I build it it's just how I am okay All right, so what I think I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and get this stuff done and uh, maybe try and get some mining done, and I will be back in a minute. And we're back. Okay, so it has been a couple days. Um, <laughs> so I kind of, let me move that a little bit back. Okay, that better for you guys? I hope so. So, I've done a lot of stuff actually. I've gotten geared up. I've got tools uh, in here. For some reason, I don't have them on me. Oh, because I put them away. Okay. So, I've gotten geared up and. Five. Okay. And I've gotten. Uh, some resources I've mined a lot and yeah I've done a lot of stuff uh, basically for the rest of this episode I want to go over uh, basically spawn town here uh, as it stands if I can find my arrows just to be sure that I've got them and I had bread in here somewhere right there okay just to make sure I have food so this is spawn town so far. Um, let's start it from over here. This is where the world spawn is over by the dungeon or the uh, jungle temple. So you come in. Uh, this is going to be a shop for Lanky. And then this is Hippie and Breeze shop. Um, a cookie shop. Looks like free special cookies. I wonder what's in those cookies. <laughs> um, over here is going to be OFC, Oat Frickin' Chicken. And then Oat's House is right here. It's kind of nice. Uh, nice little style there. Um, this is the Community House. Or Community... What, what is this called? The Community Center Town Hall. Basically our portal and then something else. Um whatever else he's going to add up here in an enchanting table always good to have and then over here this is the courthouse yes this is the courthouse um, nice little build nice uh, desert themes over here and then I think this is Mike's shop yeah, Mike's Vegan Shop coming soon. Okay, so that's Mike's place. Wiener. He's a wiener. Okay. Jag Road. Uh, that's Jag's house over here. Let's go look at that. Let's look at this. Jag's humble abode. It's a nice place. Little tree home looking thing. Um, this area here is actually my build, my community build for now. 
Uh, this is going to be the Oakenstone Police Department. So uh, we'll be build I'm going to be building this uh, probably in the next episode. I've gathered most of the resources that I need. Um, I'm still designing it. So yes, the OSPD is coming to town. Um, criminals beware. This I'm not sure what this is. I haven't looked at this. This looks kind of cool. What's this say? Emperor Red's mausoleum. Aha! So this is a uh, infrared. As of Sunday, 29th of April, 2015, at 4:30, 4:29, I should say. Here lies the most powerful emperor to walk the earth. In 180 days, he shall return, and then the world will burn. Um. Okay. Little. Oh, oh, I get it. <laughs> it's supposed to be like a mummy tomb. Okay, that that's actually kind of cool. <laughs> um, now, I'm not sure how I'm going to edit this up, but uh, in the last clip that you saw, uh, I was over here. Uh, I moved everything over there because that's where I'm going to be building the OSPD. So I wanted to make it easier for myself. And then over here, this is where Hippie and Bree live. They have a little tree house. And I fell into the water. Um, I'm not, yeah, this is Fort two, two, Population 3. Okay. So yeah, th this is uh, Hippie's and Bree's place that... Wow, they have done a really nice job in here. Jeez. The hippie snuggles tree. Okay. I'm definitely... What's this place? The hippie snuggles hole. Okay. This is a nice place. I don't want to ruin anything, so I'm going to go ahead and leave. Because I'm not sure if they've put out an episode or not. Uh, let me... Close that up so nothing gets in there. Okay. Yes. Uh, and then over here is Lanky's place so far. Um, and I think he built the bridge as well. And then there's the border for spawn. Well, I guess semi-spawn. Uh, I think they're including the couple builds over there. But, yeah, I think this is actually going to go ahead and do it for this episode. Um... I don't have much plans for the first one, um, and sorry about the uh, weird cuts, um, my recording software, uh, I ran out of space actually uh, in my uh, recording drive, so I had to fi figure that out and then fix it, and kind of uh, jump cuts everywhere, so hopefully you guys are okay with that, it's just going to be for the first episode hopefully. Um, I've actually got a lot of stuff recorded. I just need to edit it all. Um, so yeah, uh, welcome back to the channel, and I hope you guys are excited for uh, Volume 2 here. It's not a season. I I keep almost thinking it's a season. <laughs> um, it's so easy to say Season 2, though. Like, Volume 2, Season 2, it just come natural to say Season 2. Um, so, I'm going to go down here and do the outro actually um, one more clip uh, I'm gonna be showing you so far what I've got for the OSPD just so you guys can see it um, in its semi completed state um, so here you guys go and hopefully you guys are excited and I will see you guys in the next episode bye guys alright so here is the OSPD in its uh, semi-completed state. Um, I kind of wanted to go with kind of like a towered theme. Um, uh, the walls aren't completely done yet except for the front one here. This is the only one that I actually want to have uh, the windows be the main thing here. Um, because this is mainly what I want people to see and then the side walls, like over here, uh, the windows are actually going to be based off of the interior rooms. 
Um, that I think that's kind of the compromise that I have to go with. Um, I didn't decorate the pillars completely, um, just to save time. But yes, this is so far what I've got for the police department. Uh, probably a big window or something here. I was kind of basing it off of some of the Lego uh, GCPD uh, builds that I've seen there on the internet. Um, I wanted to do it kind of like that. I didn't. It, it's kind of hard with the uh, block choices here, but let's look around here for a second. Basic walls there. Um, I've got a road with cop cars or cop trucks, cop vans. I guess you can call it like the uh, SWAT tactical things. And the cool thing is you can actually go inside them. If I go into this one, you can actually go inside those trucks. Um, I think I've got an idea for what's going to be in there. <laughs> um, inside, little. Oh crap. Okay, well that's got to go there. Um, so that's good to know. But uh, this is kind of the interior for the reception area. Back here is for police only. This is going to be kind of like you you need to report a crime. Someone's going to be here. There's going to be like a chest or something. You can tell it to them. And you've got a waiting area. Haven't done a lot of decorating inside yet. But yeah, that's so far what I've got for this. And... I think it's going to be a really cool build, especially once I get it complete. Um, now, I'm, I'm trying something different with the build styles here. Um, I'm trying to do kind of depth and everything. Also, I'm trying to really detail things. Like, uh, normally I would have just put the gates, um, put them just straight across and go down. But I'm actually designing it to where it, it kind of looks like it's going up into the build itself. Uh, so it's like raising and lowering. And then I've got this kind of uh, for like a different thing for like the gate. So this way it's not just going down on the floor. It's going down onto something else. Uh, but all, the, all that kind of stuff is going to be kind of after. I just want to get the build up. Uh, up and running I should say. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode, and I'll see you guys later. I probably said this last one. So, bye guys.